What you are seeing here is the beginning of a fish life. After fertilization, the first cell in the embryo starts a sophisticated cell division program called mitosis. During mitosis, the chromosomes which carry our genetic information must be accurately segregated into the two new cells. That is what you are seeing here. The cell duplicates, then aligns, and finally segregates the chromosomes into the two new daughter cells. It is technically difficult to study mitosis in early embryos, which is why the mechanisms of embryonic chromosome segregation have long been unknown, especially for vertebrae. But now, we have managed to produce these time lapses, which help us know more about the mechanisms. We genetically modified medaka fish so that we can see the proteins embedded in separating chromosomes in fluorescent microscope. These proteins make up the mitotic spindle, shown in green in this video, which captures the chromosomes showing the magenta in the middle of the spindle and pull them into the new daughter cells. Thanks to the time lapses, we now know more about how this spindle forms in early embryos. But the time lapses also raise so many new questions. For example, the cells divide very symmetrically. How does the spindle find the cell center every time? How does the spindle know which way to orient itself across the different cells? Embryonic mitosis is beautiful and important, but very challenging to study. With our work, we hope that we can eventually get closer to understanding the processes as beginning of life.